What's up everybody? Thanks for checking out Hunt, Shoot, Live. Got a super cool episode for you guys today. I'm going to keep it short and simple. I have the Gamo Swarm Magnum 22. I've also got my Gamo Swarm Whisper 22. And I have a bolt action 22 long rifle. And you can see that I've got my Magneto Speed V3 here. I am going to uh, I'm going to test these three and just get some velocities, write it down, and I just want to see really how the mainly how the Swarm Magnum and the Swarm Whisper compare, but with the 22 as well, because um, you know that Swarm Magnum advertises some speeds that are definitely in the 22 long rifle range. So uh, super simple, I'm going to keep it short and sweet, but. Um, I think we'll get some interesting data out of this, so uh, stick around. Okay, I've actually got some little 22 shorts. I'm going to give that a go. Oh. Okay, that did it for the shorts. Let's try the long rifle. Okay, next up is the Magnum. Well, that was dang fun. You know, I only did I only did five shots of each, so you know, don't consider this a absolute gospel to go by. But I think it did give some pretty clear data in the differences. So obviously, your uh, 22 long rifle shot significantly faster. It was a 40 grain 22 long rifle. And I was not getting with those with the uh, comparing the 40 grain 22 long rifle to the Swarm Magnum with the 14.3 uh, grain Premier. Um, you know, I would think that would be in the range of, of where they're advertising that that speed, uh, but it definitely didn't get anywhere near it. The Swarm Magnum had an average feet per second of 873. It had a low of 8.55 and a high of 9.01, and it had a standard deviation of 17, which isn't terrible, uh, I would think, for a pellet rifle. Um, you know, comparatively, the 22 long rifle had a high of uh, 11.54 and a low of 11.02. So even the low of the 22 long rifle with a 40 grain bullet compared to that 14 grain pellet was 200 feet per second faster. I tried some 22 shorts and they were the slowest out of everything. Uh, they had an average speed of 521, low of 504, high of, high of 562, and a standard deviation of 23.2. Uh, my standard deviation on those 22 long rifles was 20 21.2. 
So the Swarm Whisper, it shot a low of 615 and a high of 693 with an average of 674, standard deviation of 33.2. So the, the Magnum, you know, with that, uh, comparing those averages, that's almost a, that's a 200 feet per second average difference uh, with the benefit going to the Swarm Magnum. So, uh, but you know, if you, if you guys have watched my video of my test of each one of those rifles at range, the, uh, the Swarm Magnum, was only dropping like 10 inches at 100 yards and seems like the uh, whisper was double that. So that makes sense. You know, you're definitely gonna get more range. But also uh, had some had a lower standard deviation. You know, with the Swarm Magnum had a standard deviation of 17. Swarm Whisper, standard deviation of 33.2. Uh, I shoot a lot of long range and I hand load for that. And of course, you know, you want your SDs really low because that means shot to shot consistency. So I would imagine that's the same thing with this. When your feet per second's varying all over the place, that means your impact is gonna vary. So uh, looks like, um, you know, hey, the Swarm Magnum come out ahead of the Swarm Whisper by 200 feet per second average and by uh, basically half the standard deviation. Now again, I, I know I could do this much more comprehensively, but I think that's that's enough of a difference to, and that's the difference that I anticipated really. So I, I think the, the thing that it comes down to for me, you know, when you're choosing these two rifles, do you want to pay that extra $150 difference between the Swarm Whisper and the Swarm Magnum. Uh, I don't know, that's for you to decide. But um, I love my Swarm Whisper. I really, I really, really like it. Uh, I can't wait to do some more testing on it, but um, you know, got some more videos to come uh, in the near future with that. Hope you guys enjoyed this today. Appreciate you guys for checking out Hunt, Shoot, Live. I'm gonna put the link to all these products in the video description, including that Magneto Speed. That is a awesome piece of equipment. You guys be sure to become a part of the Hunt, Shoot, Live team and subscribe and we'll see you every single week. New videos out every single week. Appreciate you guys. As always, God bless you. We'll see you next time.